Hey there, welcome to the Anarchy Gaming Channel, my name is Mephisto and we're back with some more Stardew Valley. Last time we bought a couple of more uh, seeds, we planted those seeds and uh, it's time we see what else we can do today. It seems that it will be raining so it means that we do not need to water our plants which is nice. Um, I have no idea if we met everyone. Uh, nope, not yet. So I think that's what we will try to accomplish today. See if we can meet everyone else that's left. Anyway, let's see the weather report for tomorrow. And it is going to be sunny all day. That's nice. And how's our fortune today? Uh, the spirits are s somewhat annoyed, which isn't all that good. But oh well. Let's get out here, and uh, before we head into town, uh, let's clear up this area a little bit more, because, well, it's quite still quite early in the morning, and no one will be out and about yet. Right, let me go in here, here and get my scythe. And clear these weeds. Which gives us some fibers, which is very nice. And there we go. And uh, put that there, put that in there. Yep. Oh, there we go. Now, um, do we have, no, we don't have anything else, and we don't have any money either to buy any more crops, which is eh, not very good, but our parsnips should uh, be ready any day now, which is very nice. I think it takes about four days for the parsnips to, um, uh, you know, be ready. And here we have some wiggly worms, and we find a book, which is quite nice. And we have a dandelion over here, let's collect that. Collect that dandelion as well. We have a leak there. <laughs> Finding all sorts of good stuff around, which is always nice. It's almost 9 o'clock. Um, let's go down to the beach. Maybe we can find some stuff down there. Stuff that we might be able to sell. That would be quite nice. We need a little bit of money because we really are running on fumes. Well, not even on fumes, running on empty. Mm, nope, it seems that the beach is completely devoid of anything except for these worms which gives us three clay we need 300 pieces of wood to fix that I should get to that I think um, that would be quite nice <laughs> you know what oh hey there Mayor Lewis Hi there, Cynthia, taking a break? I guess. I hope the river doesn't overflow. Uh, well, I hope so too. That would be quite bad. If it did, it could ruin quite a lot. So, um, I think I made, made my decision for today. Let's go and chop some trees down and start to collect wood to uh, finish that bridge down west at the be on the west side of the beach uh, let's put this away all right hmm, where should we start actually let me get my scythe there we go I think this is a good a, a place as any I don't know Ooh, sorry. 
you cannot use a hoe to cut down a tree. That would be ridiculous. <laughs> It's going to be take quite some time before we get enough wood to be able to, uh, you know, fix the bridge. But it will be worth it in the long run. Okay, let's clear all this. This is where I need to be chopping. Chopping away. Chopping away. And I think we. Sh I should be able. I should have enough energy to get one more tree. We will do that really quickly. After which, we will head back to town and see what else we can do. There we go. I think that's kind of quite enough for one day. <laughs> so let's head back to town now. I have no idea what that was. I should probably stop that. Oh boy. Mm, let's go to the museum. Um, let's see what that book we found is all about. <laughs> there we go. Here we go. Tips on farming. Use fertilizer to improve quality, reduce workload, or hasten crop growth. Fruit trees take a whole season to grow, but they require very little maintenance. Keep the area directly around your new sapling clear or else it may not grow properly. Crops will die as soon as the season ends, unless they grow in multiple seasons, example corn. Some crops, such as kale and wheat, need to be harvested with a scythe. And that's pretty good knowledge, I guess. This is a book by Marnie. Animals are very sensitive. They like to be pet every day and prefer to eat grass outdoors than dry hay. They don't like being outside in the rain, though. Happy animals produce higher quality products. Which is nice. I guess. Okay. Hello, Penny. The raindrops are really loud on the metal roof of our trailer. Aww. It's soothing, though. Well, I guess. Although I, I would find it quite hard to sleep with rain pounding down on a metal roof above my head. Let's talk to Clint. Hey, what do you need? Just talking. Not much other than that, really. <laughs> Joja Mart. We're not going in there. They are evil. <laughs> oh, there might be a mission for us around here. For girls only. Psst, I need green algae. You know what it's for. Keep it secret, okay? Haley. Uh, I'm not sure I know what you're talking about, Haley. But, oh well. I'm not going to accept it because I don't think I can get algae just yet, so... Um, sorry. Oh, and it's going to be Lewis's birthday on Sunday. Uh, we should try to keep that in mind and see what we can... What gift we could give him. That would be quite nice. I think I'm sure he would appreciate a gift. You know, we're still quite new around here, so 
it's worth to get, give off a good impression. Alright, let's see if the rock up here was removed. No, it hasn't. Or it wasn't. And, oh, a rusty cog. Gunther can tell us more. Well, it's 420. I'm almost certain he closed shop already, so. A warm rain is a pleasant way to get clean. Uh, I guess it is. Let's go around here. We haven't been able to do too much today, but oh well. Some more leaks, that's always nice. Let's come down over here, back to the farm. Ah, you know what? Let's chop down another tree. It seems that I still have some energy left. <laughs> I'm trying to think what to do next, really. Go back to town. Well, it's still quite early, so... Uh, let's head up the saloon. Why not? There might be someone around there. People really don't like to be out in the rain, do they? Ooh. Hmm, this weather makes me thirsty. It's a, it's a pleasure to meet you. I'm Harvey, the local doctor. Hey, Harvey. I perform regular checkups and medical procedures for all the residents of Pelican Town. It's rewarding work. I'm sure it is. I hope you'll find your work equally rewarding in time. Ah, uh, yeah. I'm pretty sure I will. Ahoy there! It's nice to see you. It's nice to see young folk moving into the valley. It's not very common these days. Hey there. Oh, you just move in, right? Cool. Out of all the places you could live, you chose Pelican Town. Well, yeah, why not? Hmm, this is not good weather for sports. Well, you'll get over it. Tomorrow is going to be a better day. Oh, well, I can always lift weights inside. Huh? Or, yeah, you could do that as well, I guess. Hmm. This, mor this morning, I accidentally stepped on a bug. Oh. Poor thing. <laughs> Sigh. Hey, kid. You're too young to be moping around in a place like this. Ah, uh, I guess. She's right, I guess. Hi there, Cynthia. I'm glad to see you. You're always welcome here. Thank you, Gus. It never rains in Calico Desert. That's where my friend Sandy lives. I wish I could visit her today. On this rainy day? Eh. Well, I guess, it, since it's not raining, it would be nicer there. Wonder if we we will ever get to go to Calico Desert. Hmm. Who knows? All right. It's starting to get a little bit late. I mean, well, you know, late. It's still still just 7 p.m. But I think it's time to head back to the farm. And I think we will call it a day. Pam 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 pam. I said I would stop that. <laughs> I really should not be singing. Actually, before we go to sleep, let's clear a couple couple more rocks here. And by a couple, I mean a dozen, or half a dozen. Uh, anyway. Alright. So that is the end of this day, and 
the end of the video, I guess. So, uh, we didn't do too much today, but uh, there wasn't much to do, really. Well, I guess we did uh, collect somewhat. Let's see how much we have. 132. Well, we're not even halfway there. So, there's still quite a bit we can... We need to collect before we can repair the bridge. But once again, that is the end of this video. Uh, I hope you enjoyed. Uh, leave your thoughts, comments, thoughts, comments, and suggestions down in the comments section below. Leave a like if you did. Uh, share this video with your friends. Subscribe if you haven't already. And click on the notification bell so you get notified whenever I upload new videos. And check out my Patreon account and maybe consider leaving a donation if you want to. But once again, that is it for this video. I hope you enjoyed. Thank you all so much for watching. See you all next time. And until then, take care and stay sharp.